Oh, this one could be gone, you know. I think that's straight off the glove. Umpire, he doesn't have to make a decision because the battle walks. So that's a really good start. Iqbal has said, again, just get strangled here. Bit of extra bounce maybe from Habib Amensai. And the first wicket falls for Donnerstadt without a run on the board. Lutmanzai finally goes for it, but he hits it up in the air. Fielder comes around and he takes the catch. And so Utman Zai just never gets going. Bit of a change of pace there from Momund, I think. And it forces the false shot. Sees early on this, the bottom of the bat. It's Habib Ahmed Zai, who has just finished his over. He skates to his left and takes the catch. So a really good start here for Graz. He's Momund. And he's knocked over first ball. And that's three down now. Like I said, Sadiq. He's about as predictable as the sun coming up in the east and the sun setting in the west. And suddenly, Momun's on a hat trick. What a start. It's four for three. Last ball, the power play. And that's more like Shigawa. He picks this one up nicely. Maximo! What was raining them yesterday. This is the first one we see of day six and it comes off the bat of Rasmo Shigawa. Up in the air. I don't think this is carrying. It isn't. Over the rope, I mean, because it's straight down the throat of Kotwal. And now Shigawal's going to have to go. So it's a six and out effectively for Raz. And that is a big wicket. The first eight comes in. And there's a bad ball first up. It's too short. And it's hit out of the ground. Maximo. Zazai takes full toll. And maybe that's the turning point. Free hit to come. Yeah, slow ball. But he picks and he hits it. So maybe that's the turning point as Girardi goes for 17 in the fifth, and it's 38 for four at the halfway point of the first innings of day six. Now this is going to be four. It's up-ish, but it's around the fielder. So Afsal's come on, changing the pace. And you see it here. It's kind of off the toe, but it's good enough. Maximo! Afsal goes the journey, and Ahmed Zai's warming up. He was careful early, wasn't he? Cotwell coming into bowl. It's hit off the back foot, hit pretty well. One bounce, four. Nice shot. Tries to force it, hangs in the air, and gone. So Zazai goes, doesn't cost him too much in the end. Again, it's good bowling. Just hanging with that channel. Okay, Zazai got one away in that region, but this time he missed times. It sets himself deep in the crease, and that's why it's a fairly simple catch for Barath Gowda. He goes after this, and he gets it. What a shot from Zadran. Only the second ball he's faced. He's got such fast hands. Well, full toss. Goes wrong. Goes very wrong for the bowler. Maximo. Sahel Zadran. Gets one out of the ballpark. Swings it away. Again, going for the block hole there. The camera duties. Anyway, this is up in the air. And this is also going. So, Maximo, back to back for Zadran. And you can see what Afsal's trying. He's trying to get up in the block hole, but he's missed full and then he's missed short, and both times he's been punished. And he takes it off this stumps and he hits this for six as well. Maximo! That's in the wheat. That's not a chase that anyone's enjoyed over the last couple of days. Around the wicket in the slot, and Adios Pelota, Af Zayn. That is out of here. Ahmed Zai has timed it perfectly. Hasn't he? Shigawal, the captain for eight. Now they're going to get lucky and they're going to get four. Yeah, that's one that is in the wheelhouse and it goes. Maximo! 19 off the ninth. Yogesh, he's going to have to do the wheat chase gallop out of there. Again, see the line. And it is a risk because this first one is just a little cutter and it ends up miles over the rope. Maximo! Donnerstadt, I mean, they're going to have what I'd call probably an average total based on what we've seen last couple of days. Bit of length on this, but straight to the fielder and gone. Nice catching. And even at this stage, that can save you. That's Momad, who's had a really good morning. It wasn't a bad shot because he throws the hands at it. And if that's five metres either side of the field, I think that's four or maybe even six. My one Momad takes a very good catch, but a good knock from Ahmed Zai. Well, bowled again. And they'll probably try for two anyway. Yeah, they'll get it on the slip. Now, we see the ball horned in. <laughs> they will get two. Safi gets his only runs of the innings. 112 will be the score. That's exactly where you want to be. Not much you can do with that at all.
Does manufacture a two out of nowhere. This will be an interesting golden ball. Shortcut gets low, and he does something which I think I've only ever seen in the gymnastics at the Olympics. But anyway, 112 is the score. Oh, what a shot. He steps down and he pumps this one. Well, that one's agricultural, not the shot, but the result. <laughs> That's going to head into the dirt. What a blow that is. That's exactly what Girani does first ball. And he sends this one out of the ground. Maximo! Two early blows for GCA. It's another one that's dirty. Charges and gets enough of it. That's out of here. Maximo! Ahmed Zai goes large. Getty just runs at Dita. Let's go a bit shorter this time. They go on contact. If this is out, it's gone. I mean, yeah, I mean, they both decide to go. Picks up to his left, has one stump, and hits it. Bang. And he's barely in the picture. He just keeps on walking. What a piece of fielding. That's the kind of thing you practice it all the time. 15 off 10 at the moment. And goes a little dab. Smart batting. It's a really good shot, really, with no third man in play. Right, he steps across, gets the end of the bat on it. And this is going to run away for four. It's just enough. I won't say it was pretty. See, the paces have gone for plenty more often than not. This could be gone, and it is gone. He's dragged it to mid-wicket, and that's Sadiq that's taken the catch. Well, he didn't have to move. He's got company now. But that's, that's a break, really, because that could have gone anywhere. Having to go straight to Mohamed Sadiq, and it's 37 for two. I even squinted. This should be gone. It is gone. Shigawal takes the catch. And Suffy goes. Never really got motoring. Razmal shakes it like a Polaroid picture because that stung, but it, it'll sting more if it dropped out of his hands. 39 for three. See, this would have been a wide. Instead, it'll get more than one. It'll probably reach the rope. It does. Cuatro Cadenas. All right, he launches this one, and here's the counter-attack coming, Safi. Oh, he's going to rattle the cage. Maximo! This is all right, down the leg side. Well, that's better. And, uh, well, it's good for the, for the batter as well. It's going to be four runs. Cuatro Carreras, not a great throwback, if I'm honest. That's better, and it induces a shot, which is down the ground, but it has the legs. Maximo! Yeah, Safi said, yeah, give me a bit more room. That's what I want. He still yeah, challenged him to hit down the ground, but he was up to it. Three overs left. And he knocks him over first ball. It's full, it's straight, it hits the target. And look, even Safi has to congratulate Dida, who comes up with the goods. And he was right on the money here. And so maybe another momentum swing coming back to Donnerstadt. Oh, again, full toss, but he can't quite get there. They're going to take on a two. Good throw. Haven't been trouble. Well, if that's hit the stumps, I think he's gone. Goes straight. Got it. Saying, all right, come on. It's worth taking on. Probably feels like he's kind of dispensable. Throw comes in. Yeah, it's gone. You can see there. Just flicks the top. I wasn't sure what hit the stumps there. thought maybe it was the... Yeah, you can see he's just gone. Great effort from Gowda to get home, but he's run out. Off the pad. Now there's a bit of a mix-up. Oh, I think this is gone, you know. Yeah. He's not even, I mean. I think you've got to give that out. And you just have a look at this acrobatic stuff from Zazai. Again, instincts took over, despite that slightly injured knee. And I think that Momar knew he was in trouble. So, Balagi comes out at eight. That's very low, you know. Short and pulled away and gone. Straight to the fielder. And that's Itibada, Itibasha Dida. That picks up Balagi for a second baller. And so, Grant started with so much promise in this game, but it's, it's ending quietly, isn't it? 93 for eight. Well, he won't get a four for. 
I think this game is going to end with a single. So plenty of action for most of that game. In the end, Grant's not quite able to crack the triple digits. The final score here in match 26, Donnerstadt 112, Grant's Cricket Academy 98. But uh, a really fun game to start the day.